Hello, today we are going to compare now and then of Stockbridge, Edinburgh. Hello, how are you? Hope you're all happy and healthy and well out there. It has been forever since I did one of these videos and I love doing these. I don't know why I haven't done one in ages, but I was just, I was sitting there just a night or two ago and I always sort of plan out as much as I can, at least with a day to spare of what I'm going to film. Um, and then I was like, I haven't done a now and then for absolutely ages and I find myself in Stockbridge more and more now because in, uh, some of you might know you might not know this but I've now got a radio show on Edge 2 which is an Edinburgh radio station um, so I find myself in Stockbridge at least once a week you know to do the show and it's a beautiful area so I thought well well I've never done that I've never done now and then for Stockbridge so I started looking I found some beautiful pictures that we can compare so so let's do that because it's fun uh, by the way there's a link there's a link underneath the video and all the descriptions where you can you know go buy some clamoring for merchandise i mean look at this how stylish is that yeah just me no go on you know you want it uh, right let's go to picture number one okay so here's the first picture roughly i think now this i can tell you this here is already going to be annoying because I think roughly here is where the picture is. So let me show you, let me show you the picture. Because I think that's bang on. I think that's bang on. Even the, the curb here is in the picture. Unfortunately, this now is in the way. So let's look at what we can see without me moving a little bit and ruining the, the how perfect. I've got that on my first go. This building here, I mean, that's the same building, isn't it? It's exactly the same building. Nothing's changed, nothing's changed. The bridge looks different. It looks like a different bridge now. Can we look as well? I know this is obvious, but how much traffic and people is going on here? In this picture, all you can see is two policemen standing in the middle of the road. That's it. Anyway, this bridge, it's a different bridge. It's definitely a different bridge. Or is it? No, well, no, 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 no. It could be the same bridge. It just seems bigger nowadays. But looking at, you can't quite see it, but this spike here, that's still there. And the change in the levels of the bridge at the street sign there, that's still there as well. I don't think you would keep that if you changed the bridge. You would make it all even, wouldn't you? So that must be the same bridge. I st Ow! And actually, it's very fainted. But on the picture, you can see this black bit. And uh, here, the, pic the, the, the wall now isn't new, so it's all kind of dark with soot and car fumes and things. But that's there as well. So no, that's, I stand corrected, it's the same bridge. Obviously, obviously over here we now have trees, so we can't see the buildings behind, but looking through the trees there, that looks all different, doesn't it? No, 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 I stand corrected again, that is definitely that building there. I think there is buildings behind here that look different, but that's the same, that's the same. Um, and looking down to the high street there as well, the main street, that all looks the same as well. So very little's changed. Uh, this picture's from the early 1900s, I should say, as well. So very little's changed there. That's brilliant. It's just the trees um, and the amount of things on the road. And the, and the cobbles stop here now, whereas they did used to go all... Oh, you can see the whole road was cobbled, but now it just stops by the traffic lights here. And I'm going to have to move so you can see what is behind here. Let me move. There we go, there we go. Look at that. That is the same as well. It's got a little extension on it. It's got a little change and I can actually see right up here the brickwork. I will zoom in if I can. Let me, let me just get to you. Now you see here, you see these, see that? See that, see that, see that? You can see the shape of the, what that used to be on the picture. Oh, it's went out of focus, hang on. 
there we go. You can see the shape of what used to be on the picture there. But now it's got this sort of extension here instead. So apart from that, I think that's the only major change to this. How good is that? How good is that? I can almost... That's actually maybe almost better, although we haven't got the curb. Wow. What a way to start. What a way to start. Look at that. So you could come down to Stockbridge and barring some obvious alterations, traffic lights and things, you could say, hey, this looks almost the exact same it did just over a hundred years ago. Love it. Absolutely love it. What a great way to start. I forgot, I forgot how much I love doing these videos, just comparing. And it's kind of a two-edged sword because that one there, there's not a lot of change. It's very similar to how it used to be, which is great and exciting and good to know. However, there's very little for me to compare and look at. I, I mean, there'll be minor changes, but the buildings are all the same. The buildings are all the same, which is exciting. Isn't that, isn't that good? You go, this is exactly how it was over a hundred years ago. Sometimes it's exciting to stand there and, and see some major changes mixed in with old stuff. It's kind of depressing when it's all gone and it's all different. But that, that, that was fun. I enjoyed that. Let's go find another one. Okay, here we go. Look at this. The old sort of archway to the Stockbridge Market. Now... I can already see the picture. There's a very, very little difference, which again is very exciting. Let me show you the original. There's some obvious changes, some obvious changes, but uh, the street, even the street light, looks the same. That looks the same, doesn't it? Obviously, you can see there's some trees and shrubbery and things. Let's ignore that. Um, that's obviously the same archway, which is great. We've gone again from Cobbled Streets to Tarmac, which is a shame. Not much we can do about that one. Over here... Oh, which one is it? Which one is it? Let me count the doors. One, that that one that is now... Yeah, this one right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks like it was a shop, doesn't it? Looks like a shop to me. Yeah, Fry's. Fry's shop. Uh, the window's a different window because it used to be a shop window. Um, let's see what else there is. Looks like there used to be a sign on the wall there as well. About here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me zoom in on the thing. To let. Stall. Oh, they, they had stalls to let in the market. <laughs> That's cool. Um, but that looks the same. I'm interested in what these are. Can you go into the, Is that part of these houses? I'd love to know. That's cool if it is. Or is it the back end of a house? I don't know. Whatever it is, it's cool. Obviously, they didn't have the bollards then. The two people lost in history that are just leaning talking there, they're gone. But that's that's almost the same, isn't it? Like, I'd, I'm really... Com like, I'm being picky. Really picky to try and find the difference. The shop is the biggest difference. I'm sure some of the windows are, you know, a little bit different. I'm hoping that they've put double glazing in now. But then looking at some of these older windows, I'm not sure. Look at that. Isn't that incredible? So again, again, you could come to this part of uh, Stockbridge and just look at the area and go, this is exactly the same as it was just over a hundred years ago apart from the street and the fact that one shop is now turned into possibly someone's house it's exactly the same oh I love this I love this okay one left to do we're going back a little bit further in time now to the late 1800s rather than the sort of early 1900s the picture isn't as good quality as the two we've had it's a little bit more grainy but we still should be able to get something, but I need to move to a different part of Stockbridge for that. So let's go. Change of plan. I couldn't get to where the picture was taken. Um, it was just impossible. The picture, the more I looked at it, the more I like, the quality is not great. But when I tried to get the spot, which you know I like to do, I like to try to match it. 
One, there's just too many cars parked on that road now to kind of see looking up at the building. And two, I probably would have had to stand in the middle of the road to get an angle where I wasn't getting blocked by the car. So it was just impossible. It was just impossible. So thanks to modern day technology, I've found another picture on my phone just now. And we've moved from Stockbridge. We're down at the shore of Leith. So let's go have a look at this one. And here we are at the shore of Leith. Looking, um, what way are we looking? We're looking east. East here, that's the water of Leith right below you there. And uh, the clock at the corner and you can see a bridge. Yep, everyone got that? Right, let me show you the picture that we've got here now a lot the same and there's a lot different and it's impossible for me to get the angle of this picture because I think it is but on the building behind me it's got a little balcony so I think it's on that and I can go to that so we'll just have to suffer with what I've got here but I think it's actually maybe a little bit closer and let me just I think it's closer to maybe that yeah, yeah, I think that's about right. So, right, first off, first off, this here, that's a new building. That's a different building. We can see that right away. So let's just right off that building right away. You know the dock looks different. Um, oh, can we? Uh, I kind of have zoomed in too close, and you can't really see the water now, can you? Need a bit more water. There we go. Um, the dock is different because you can see there's sort of posts on the, the dock. They're all gone, so they've done something to the dock there. That's different. Um, the This building looks the same. So right on the corner. This looks exactly the same. I really like on the original how they've got the bags of flour or something outside. That's incredible. It just gives it so much character, doesn't it? The only thing I'm really noticing is if we pan up to here, see this sort of spire, spike on the top? That's not there on the top of this picture. It looks unfinished. Oh, no, no, no. It's just been cut off. It's just been cut off. So, all right. Okay. Okay. So that building looks the same. The corner looks the same. That's cool. Now, the bridge. The bridge here looks very different that's a different bridge so you can see that here looks like there was a, a more of an angle really wasn't there it goes out a little bit the street lights are still there but they're completely different street lights i wonder if that part of the bridge moved on the original maybe maybe not i don't know um so the bridge is different it's it they've rebuilt the bridge and I've got to say, the original bridge looks nicer. This one just doesn't look nice at all. This building is the same building. It's the same building, it's just painted differently. So you can see in the original, the pub at the bottom is still there, and then the first floor seems to be painted. And then this top bit here, this second floor is not painted. Oh, there's windows gone in the roof. See up here, right at the top, there's a there's a window, a small window about here, which is gone from that building now. Obviously, they've redone the roof and taken that out for some reason. I wonder why. That's intriguing. And the building behind it, that looks the same. Going backwards, going along there, I know I can't get the same angle, but that looks the same. Uh, the building on the corner there looks the same as well. So, isn't it funny how, at a glance, it can look very, very similar? But then once you actually get down to the nitty-gritty of it, it's very, very different. And I know we're not really concentrating on it because it's not really in the picture, but the edge of this, of this white building is in the picture. And looking at the original, that's a different... This is a newer building. This is a newer building than that one. I've not really got a year for this picture, unfortunately. Um, 
Do I have a year for it? No. And that's a shame. That's a shame I don't know the year of this picture. If anyone happens to know, then please let me know. Look at Isn't that great though? Isn't it exciting? I love doing this comparison. I could do it all day. It's funny, looking at the original picture though, and it's obviously because of the the type of photo it is, how they took photos, the technology. It just looks like a set. It looks like a set from a film. It looks absolutely beautiful and clean. And again, quiet. So quiet, because I suppose the exposure would have to be longer, because if you look down here, you can see the ghost of a horse and cart, which has obviously moved at some point, so the exposure would have had to be for a while, but there's very little. And again at the bridge, look at the bridge there, you can see probably the same horse and cart. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? But there you go, there you have it, there's our, there's our third one here at the waters of Leith at the shore. Oh, I love it. I love these comparisons. Thank you for letting me do this today. Thank you for joining me. So there you have it. There you have it. That's that's what we've just been uh, comparing behind me there. Isn't it cool? Isn't it cool? I love doing stuff like this. Hope you've enjoyed that today. Hope you've enjoyed me geeking out over old pictures and, and comparing them. If you have, as always, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, remember, you can buy this if you want. Um, or become a patron. I put lots of stuff on Patreon. Um, um, sorry, there were two ducks upside down in the water, which caught my eye there for a second. Just the bum sticking out of the water. Uh, you can become a patron. Um, I put personal vlogs on there. I put uh, a picture of the week, which is this sort of thing. Old pictures of Edinburgh that I find. And uh, I do a Zoom call. You can, you, you know, you can come, come be a patron. Um, uh, Till next time, uh, keep yourself happy and healthy and safe and everything. Bye, humans. Thank you.